report, Time magazine to name Linda Sarsaw her person of the year after she called for jihad against Trump. Time magazine says Trump was never in the running for person of the year after the president claimed the magazine told him he was being considered and requested an interview. Perhaps calling for jihad against the Trump administration while pushing for Sharia law in the United States deems one a person of the year, says one report familiar with Time's editors. Israel National News reported that Linda Sarsaur is most likely Time magazine's pick for person of the year. Speaking of which, Linda Sarsaur. Now there's Time's most likely pick to represent 2017. She is the picture, the image of everything gone to pot over the past nearly 12 months. Time's editors won't put it that way of course. They will ascribe to her, this so-called Palestinian American, all the glories of the women's movement, whatever that is anymore. But they do march for equality of the sort we find in certain Islamic countries where all women are equally put to death for disobedience. Like forgetting to wear that special veil, which Sir Sa'er never forgets, even though some might say it signifies bondage rather than emancipation. Sir Sa'er is a leader in all that, and she is front and center in the resistance movement against Trump. Times editors love that about her. She hates Trump. What more can you ask when you are part of old media? They want open borders and so does she. Bring them all in. Imagine America with millions more like Linda or Sa'er. Trump wants refugees out from places like Iran, Libya, Somalia, Syria and Yemen for reasons of safety. They breed terrorists over there. Trump wants America kept safe. Linda or Sa'er wants them in. Those are people with which she feels most comfortable. That's one reason Trump won't get this year's nod from time, but perfect for Linda Sarsaer. Linda Sarsaer is a radical left-wing activist masquerading as a leader of women's rights while she pushes for Sharia law the most oppressive set of laws which ultimately enslave women. Sarsaer called for jihad against Trump. As previously reported, speaking at ISNA's 54th annual convention. Linda stated that Muslims have no need to assimilate and that fighting the Trump administration is a form of jihad. And I hope that when we stand up to those who oppress our communities, Sir Sa'er continued, that Hala accepts from us that is a form of jihad. Linda Sir Sa'er has ties to the terrorist group, Hamas and is a Sharia law advocate who pushes to replace our constitution with laws from a medieval death cult. Fun fact, Sir Sa'er means cockroach in Arabic. Fitting. Isn't it?